welcome back to the Cracking Fang YouTube channel. Today we're solving the daily lead code question 1455. Check if a word occurs as a prefix of any word in the sentence. Given a sentence that consists of some words separated by a single space and a search word, check if search word is a prefix of any word in the sentence. Return the index of the word in sentence, where the search word is a prefix of this word. If search word is a prefix of more than one word, return the index of the first word, minimum index. If there's no such word, return minus one. Um, okay. Cool. So for example, if we have sentence, I love eating burger, great. Um, and the search word is burg, then obviously it's there because it's the prefix of the last word burger, in which case we can return true. Um, so this, pre this problem, pretty straightforward. All you really need to do is just check all of the words and see whether or not the search word um, is a prefix of the beginning of the word. And if it is, you return true. If you get through all the words and you haven't returned true, then obviously it's not. Uh, so you just return uh, minus one. So that's really all you wanna do is first, we just need to split the string on the white spaces and then just check every single word, um, whether or not the first, you know, whatever length of the search word is, if those characters match, then you're good to go. Otherwise just return false. So let's just um, code this up pretty straightforward. So we want to split the words. So we're going to say words equals um, sentence dot split. So this will split on the white space. And then we basically just want to check um, all of the words um, as we go along. So we're going to say for I um, word in enumerate. So we want to go through with the index words. And we're going to start with one. Actually, I forgot to read it out, but um, basically it's for some reason they are, where is it? Oh, one index instead of zero index. So that's why we start at one instead of zero. Uh, so we're going to go through all of the words and we're going to basically going to say if word starting from the beginning of the word up until the length of the search word, if slicing this equals to search word, um, then we basically return the index um, because we have found a word. Otherwise, basically we'll move on to the next word. So if no match is found, then we simply return minus one. Okay, so that should be it. We can run this, submit it, and of course it's accepted. Pretty straightforward question. Uh, time and space complexity, let's see. So for the time complexity, the first thing we need to do is actually split the sentence. So this is gonna be big O of N. Then we obviously need to go through all of the words uh, that we have. So this is going to be big O of W times, we then need to actually slice the string. So we're going to say that this is big O of M. So here, um, N equals length of the sentence, sentence, W equals number of distinct words uh, in the sentence, and then M equals length of longest uh, word in the sentence. And then for the time uh, for the space complexity, Obviously, we need to split the words. Um, so this is just going to be big O of N because uh, we need to store them uh, after splitting. So that's how you solve this question. Relatively easy. Mostly just did it so I don't feel lazy for not making videos. Um, but yeah, pretty straightforward. Nothing too crazy here. If you enjoyed the video, why not leave it a like and a comment? It helps me out with the YouTube algorithm. Subscribe for more content like this and I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.